kids are very challenged right now, and I think everybody kind of knows that. And there's just so many things that we take for granted that we throw away that could help them, even the little small stuff like aluminum cans. Um, there's people in this community that have taken aluminum cans out of the trash to feed their families, and here we are throwing it away. So we have to be mindful of just the little the small things that we take for granted that we throw away other people can use. Little things like running your water. Um, we take for granted when you, for instance, you, when you brush your teeth, the water continues to run. Well, people not too far away from you, they don't even have running water. So we have to be mindful of this stuff, and it's hard. But that's what kids are going through. 10500 is the, the future. It's the future of nonprofits that deal with obesity. Obesity is a, is one of the top killers in, in, in the African American community. So what we do, we use sports fashion and art to combat obesity and to get corporate America and also uh, the local community involved to fight this, this plague that's hurting our community. So, what 10500 has become well noted for is naturally the skateboarding, and not only the skateboarding, but the art that, uh, that we see often on uh, t-shirts and skateboards and things like that. So that comes with the uh, 10500 art collaborative. We really love uh, using the art because art, as you know, goes with fashion, and so there's a lot of kids in this community they don't have a way to get into the, not only the art um, industry, but also into the fashion industry. So we use the, some of the local uh, community and talent and incorporate them and try to find them job placement um, once they get those skills. And so the nonprofit, not only does it um, create jobs, but it also creates love and unity in